and welcome to Open Source Systems Screencast. This is the VirtualBox Screencast. Uh, VirtualBox is an open source virtualization product which allows you to run virtual machines within your computer that uh, you can essentially download and run a, different, a number of different computers within your computer. What that means is, for example, on my Macintosh here running OS X, I can actually run a full Windows uh, desktop on my Mac using all the Windows tools as if I was running a Windows machine. It is essentially the exact same thing. Uh, and I'm going to go ahead and show you how to download this open source tool, install it, and uh, in future screencasts, show you how to install the operating systems to get you set up with the virtual machine. An another benefit of virtualization is that I can actually take a, a snapshot of my virtual machine at any time. What this allows me to do as a security researcher is I can essentially work with malware or even completely destroy my virtual computer and then I can always revert back to a pristine snapshot and my computer will be perfectly fine as if nothing had ever happened to it. So it's a very useful tool, a useful feature uh, and I'm going to demonstrate how to do all that as well. So the first thing we need to do is get VirtualBox. We can go to the website uh, virtualbox.org directly or we can just search for VirtualBox on Google the first link that comes up here, Oracle VM VirtualBox. I'm going to click on that. On the left over here, you'll see Downloads. Click that. Uh, depending on your host system, so if you are currently right now on a Windows box, or if you are on a Mac with OS X, or if you're on a Linux box, feel free to download which, uh, which download, which installer works for you. I'm going to click the Macintosh here. So we're going to go ahead and let that download. We're going to fast forward through this. Excellent. Now that you've downloaded VirtualBox, go ahead and click the link to open up the, uh, the installer. It's going to verify the installer, and then it's going to open up a window that will allow us to install the application. So essentially all we have to do is we have to double click on this package installer, open it, and go through the installation process. So we're going to click continue. It's going to let us know how much uh, space we need to, to have on our hard drive. Install. OS X requires that we put in our password to verify the installation. And it's going to run through the install. Excellent. And that's it. We now have VirtualBox installed on our computer. It was that easy. And I'm going to go ahead and open it. To do so, all we need to do is we need to go to our applications folder over here. And we're going to go to VirtualBox, which should be right here. Double click the application, and it will open. So this is it. You can see I have already installed VirtualBox, so I have a virtual machine on my VirtualBox install now. This window should be empty on a fresh install. Uh, then for the next screencast, I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate how to install, uh, set up a virtual machine. In this case, we're going to set up CentOS, which is a free Linux distribution that's based on Red Hat. And that will be the next screencast. Yeah.